Previously on Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Just kidding, it's only Yu-Gi-Oh. Goddamn smartass! You think you can... Shelly, we're watching that! Go back! Shut up, turd! I'm liking Buffy! The only thing that keeps me going is just the thought of holding you and stroking your hair and being with you in a perfect golden moment. Oh yeah, I'm totally the same way. Oh, I'm just so... Are you watching Buffy? I can do both. So what, what is it you do? So, what is it you do? I work in television. Oh my god, I love TV. Buffy is my life. <laughs> I'm so into Willow being a les. Did you have anything to do with that? Oh no, I'm a sports writer. I write news, sports, you know, like that. Dennis, I know this is an ooky situation for everyone, but you and I were friends once. Oh, were we? Remember calling each other during Buffy? <laughs> I don't remember that. <laughs> when Angel found the chalice of poison and you freaked out. The battle between good and evil is something we should all care about. What happened? Did something happen to Tommy? Tommy? No. Last night on Buffy. It's so true. Sarah Michelle will never be happy with anyone but Angel. <laughs> you know, Sarah Michelle Geller is really smart. I mean, at the beginning of this interview, she's just talking about stuff like where she gets her highlights, but then she starts in on foreign affairs and campaign finance reform. Huh. Interesting, yeah. See, these pages are stuck together. You've been reading an interview with John McCain. <laughs> Here's the rest of Sarah Michelle. Are we really gonna do this? Sure. It's a perfect plan. How's it gonna work? I don't know. You go to a clinic, you watch an episode of Buffy the Vampire Slayer, nine months later, we're done. Yeah, I probably should have figured it out when she started talking about her time in a POW camp. <laughs> Ooh, uh, before I forget, I need you to write me a check. Uh, there's this guy, Ted Bowers, he's running for city council. I really think we should support him. Well, what do we know about him? He's gay. And? And he's gay. But what's he for? I mean, you know, where does he stand on the issues? What do you care? You thought Buffy was in a prisoner of war camp. <laughs> Phoebe's a porn star! What? what? No. Yeah. Oh, Phoebe Buffet what? in Buffet the Vampire Lair. Well, where should we go for brunch? Griddler on the roof? Thank God it's fried eggs? Bodacious frittatas? Buffet the Hunger Slayer? I want to say one. Be my guest. Play is not bad. I just don't buy that Xena. There's the opening of Buffus, the back eye slayer, across the street. So here's the story. You stink is being chased by vampires. That's Buster and Arthur. Cool. I want to suck your blood. Then I come and save you. Behold, I am Muffy the Vampire Slayer. And we sing some of the song. Anyway, that's it. Any questions? It's okay. They can't get in. According to a legend from 13th century AD, and of course, second season of Buffy, vampires cannot enter your house unless you invite them in. Not gonna happen. Oh, I hate cemeteries at night. I hate cemeteries at day. What was that? Uh... Huh. Probably a zombie or a vampire. Great. Where's Buffy when you need her? What's the story, guys? Take a look. Ouch. Are you kidding me? Is that a stake in his heart? Looks like Buffy's visiting the Big Apple. I, I found a way to make our relationship work. You found yourself a vampire. I met a girl online. And uh, what is her name? I know her as Buffy227 at gmail.com. Okay, I admit, I'm a geek. You a Greek? No, a geek, sweetie. I love it all. Star Trek, Star Wars, Buffy, Xena, Akira. I even watch Fringe. Voice recognition scan incomplete. Please state your password. I don't know. Guess. <laughs> Dougie the Vampire Slayer. Voice recognition complete. Access granted. Uh, Fletcher sent us. He said you could show us the way to Magar Peak. Buffy, I implore you to be careful. There are demons lining the path, 
every step of the way. Uh, WB Marathon. In America? They can't just cancel a show like Alphas. You know, they have to help the viewers let go. Yeah, Firefly did a movie to wrap things up. Buffy the Vampire Slayer continued on as a comic book. Heroes gradually lowered the quality season by season till we were grateful it ended. Lord Jesus, could you please encourage Cleveland to go with Terry in his hot, firm magnet so I can catch up to his sales? Hey, Tim, will you be all right if I leave you? Oh, yeah, yeah, have a good time. Thanks, Jesus. Okay, now maybe we can talk about bringing back Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Come on, take that lightsaber and try to strike me down, and your journey toward the dark side will be complete. I've seen a lot of ships get blown up. It's no big deal. Yeah, I guess that wouldn't get under my skin either. Not the way Seth Green gets under my skin. Huh? Yeah, boy, that guy rubs me the wrong way. I mean, has he ever made anything successful? Greg the Bunny, Four Kings, and that god-awful puppet show. It's on, like, Channel 100 or something. Well, I think he's had some successes. Buffy the Vampire Slayer was popular. Wow, Wesleyan University's own Joss Whedon, creator of Buffy, Angel, Firefly, and Dollhouse. Thanks for meeting with us. We kind of have a favor to ask. Oh, good! I've been looking for a way to repay you for bailing on Buffy after two seasons. Anything, Seth, really. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. <laughs> we'll be through the criminal justice system and home in time for Buffy. Good thinking, Daria. Shut up, Shorty. <laughs> With their new souls, nothing could stop the lettuce head, kids. That's where I come in. I'm Buffy. I fight evil. It's what I do. And that's how season eight would have started. Jesus, no wonder you quit. I'm sorry. I'm hit. I'm blind, Buffy. OK, be brave. OK, W-W-B-D. What would Buffy do? Huh? No, but Ed, she's stronger than me. It's okay. Hey. You know what I really wish would come to Marthaville? Huh? Buffy. A blade. Or any one of those badass vampire killers who take care of Mr. Bill Compton. That's what I wish. Kryptonite. Silver bullet. Buffy. What's it gonna take to keep you in the grave? Is that a good hmm or a bad hmm? No, it's a good hmm. If we printed tabloid nonsense like the Inquisitor does, but we're the Daily Planet, and tall tales about slaying Buffy the Vampire don't make it into the pages of a real newspaper. Miss Khan, I didn't make this up. <sighs> what are you doing? Helping you out. Damon! Come on, Buffy. Stop it! <sighs> I think you walk on water, don't you? I'm pretty sure that was Moses. No, it was Jesus. Moses parted the Red Sea. And what the hell was the deal with you snapping the American flag in half like you some Muslim Buffy with a dick? Humans do not live as long as Sebations or Hynarians or Delvians. When I get back, everyone, my dad, DK, my sisters, Cameron Diaz, Buffy the Vampire Slayer will be dead. Well, you may never see these people again anyway. Can I hurt you? No, 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 no. I am completely dead. <laughs> anyway, it's going to be fine. Hey, there's a werewolf called Nina in Buffy. I've never seen it. No. No, well, I, I stopped watching it once, you know, started living it. You really like him, don't you? I don't know him. When does that ever stop people from fancying each other before? You see, the same thing happened to me once with Buffy the Vampire Slayer. I admit she's a fictional character, but, you know, when it feels real. Wait, vampires don't run people limb from limb, do they? Uh, not traditionally. Here, try this on for size. Oh, I'm gonna get my Buffy on. 
Hopefully you won't. Vampires have been extinct ever since a middleman killed the last one in the late 1800s. Here's the vessel for your next soul. Tracy Reed. Thought she was a vampire when she was alive. Seriously? She was a vampire? <laughs> well, you do know that vampires don't really exist, don't you, Sam? She's just a murderer who liked to drink people's blood. Oh, looking sharp, Buffy. Looking sharp. Hey, Fern, what up, girl? What do you want, Buffy? Tiffany, whatever your name is. The female voice in Celtic literature. I am woman, hear me bore. With all the TV Sheldon was talking about, I had the greatest idea ever. It even blows away my idea for a Star Wars-themed coffee shop called Brubacas. <laughs> you need to watch Buffy the Vampire Slayer. It is the perfect show for the two of us. It's got action and jokes and hot vampires and romance. I cannot oversell this. What do you say? It's 6.30 in the morning. Oh, oh so sorry. It's my fault. Sorry. Oh. Oh. Interesting reading material for a 13-year-old girl. Oh. I can explain. Really? Then by all means explain the uh, connection between Mother Teresa and Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Daughter, homework, hero. Gotcha. How do I look? Where are you going? I'm putting myself out there, Rory. Now? Yes, now. It's 11 o'clock at night. Who are you hoping to hook up with now, Spike and Drusilla? Just tell me if my lipstick is too whorish. Nope, just whorish enough. I'm not really a praying man, and um, I never really ask you for much. So if you could just see your way clear to helping me today, I would be really, really grateful. Thank you very much. Amen. Grr. Arg. Blamo! Arg. I... No! Arg. Arg. My baby! Oh! There is no God! Come on, Joss. That's why you got kicked off Wonder Woman. Grr! Arg!